Hey guys, it's Chris here from Bounty Devices, and in this video we're going to show you some different methods for flashing one of our OS images onto one of our boards, and we'll be using images for our Nitrogen 8M Mini as an example. Let's check it out. The first method we're going to show you for flashing an OS image is by programming an SD card using a tool from our partners Bellina called Etcher. We find this to be the easiest method for flashing an image. After installing and starting Etcher, select an image. In this case, we've preloaded our Ubuntu Bionic image. Select a target. In this case, we have inserted a 16 gig SD card and simply hit flash. When complete, you can eject the SD card, insert into the board, and boot to Ubuntu. The next method for flashing an OS image that we will show you is by programming the EMMC, once again using Etcher. In order for the EMMC to be visible as a drive on our Linux system, we will need to use UMS. As you can see in the instructions on the screen, you will connect a serial cable and micro USB cable into the board that are connected to your PC. Then we will open a serial terminal and simply enter one command that's shown here on your screen. So let's open up a terminal, power on the board, interrupt the boot process and go into uBoot prompt by pressing any key and enter that command, UMS MMC0. Now we can flash an image using Etcher. Select the image. In this case, we have preloaded our Yocto Zeus image. Select the target. As you can see, the EMMC of the Nitrogen 8M Mini shows up as a drive on our Linux system. So let's select it and hit flash. When complete, you can boot the board to Yocto Zeus. The next method for flashing an OS image is by programming the EMMC using Fastboot. In this example, we will be using our Android 10 image. First, insert a serial cable and micro USB cable into the board that are connected to your PC. And then we'll download the Nitrogen 8M Mini image and unzip it. Then we will open a serial terminal and type one command shown here on the screen, fastboot0. So let's go ahead and do that. Go into the uBoot prompt, enter the command. Now let's open a Linux terminal on our PC and make sure we can see the board under LSUSB. Here it is shown highlighted on the screen. Now before we can flash via fastboot, we need to set up a UDEV rule for this Nitrogen 8M Mini device. So let's view our system's UDEV rules. As you can see, we already have a rule preset. So simply add a rule as shown highlighted on the screen for the Nitrogen 8M Mini device. So now we are ready to flash the device via Fastboot. So let's go to the directory where we unzip the image and run the flash Fastboot script. As you can see, it is starting to flash. Now let's go over to our serial console and see that it's flashing. Once complete, you can boot to Android. The last method we're going to show you for flashing an image is by loading our auto program EMMC package onto an SD card or USB stick. After completion, you can simply insert the SD card or USB stick into the board and it will automatically flash an image to EMMC. So let's grab the package from our Linode server and go into that directory and get things set up.
As you can see, we've already placed our Yocto Zeus image into this directory. So now let's run the script. First provide the script name, followed by zero, which indicates EMMC, followed by the name of the image you wish to flash, and finally, the name of the image that we will be flashing onto the SD card or USB stick. So now after running the script, it's beginning to create the image. So let's see what the boot up will look like after flashing this image and inserting the SD card or USB stick into the board. So power on the board. And as you can see, it will start flashing. When complete, you can remove the SD card, reboot the board, and then boot to Yocto.